And I think that that's not true. You needed a real actor and, and uh, who really took it seriously, and, and Peter really did. Peter you know, took it seriously from a physical standpoint. He studied mime, and he did this, and he developed this whole thing. And, and in, in retrospect, you, you can't imagine the movie without Peter. It was anyhow difficult to, 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 to find the actor because we needed somebody, as, as has been pointed out several times. I mean, it, somebody was a really good jawline, isn't it? <laughs> because this was, this was, you see only this, isn't it? Weller was probably the best person we could get. He was a marathon runner, he was very skinny, and so when you put him in the suit, he looks like a normally proportioned person, but if you put a normally, uh, an actor with a normal physique inside that suit, he looks too big. He really captures the feeling of the robot, physically, uh, you know, vocally, everything, and you really feel like he's solid as a rock.